Hey everyone, it's Anthony from Pretty Printer here. Today's video is going to be pretty quick. I just want to talk about how to change the port when you are running your Flask app through the command line interface. So before in previous versions of Flask, you would use the if name equals main block, and then you can do something like app run and then change the port here. So let's say port 1000. But instead of doing that, you can do it on the command line interface as well, which is the recommended way of doing it. So first I'm going to export my Flask app, which is app.py. I technically don't need it because it automatically looks for app.py when I don't specify it, but just to make it explicit, I added it there. And we see when we run it uh, with nothing, just the default configuration, it runs on port 5000. So you see that here, and if I go here I see hello world. But if I want to change that port for whatever reason, so for example I have a couple of flask apps that I'm running in the case where I'm doing something like creating an API and testing that API at the same time, then I will want two different apps and of course they can't be on the same port so I'd have to change the port for at least one of them. So I'll stop my server and there are a couple of ways you can do it. You can uh, edit the configuration variable, so flask run port is the name of it and then you set it to something so in this case I'll set it to 8000 and I use the wrong command it's not flask it's export export flask run port equals 8000 and then I do flask run and then we see it's on port 8000 so if I refresh the one with uh, port 5000 it's going to tell me that I can't find unable to connect but if I go to 8000 it works so that's one way of doing it. The other way is what I kind of started to do. So flask run, and then you do dash dash port and equals whatever you want the port to be. So in this case, let's say port 2000. And then we see down here it's running on port 2000. So if I change this and run it, it's working. And if I try to go back to port 8000, it no longer works. So just a quick video, like I said, it may be useful if you don't like the default port of 5000 or you have multiple Flask apps running on one computer at the same time, so you want to have different ports so you can actually use them at the same time. So I hope that helps. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please subscribe. So thank you for watching and I will talk to you next time.